Welcome to Polymer Update TV, the world's first and only TV network with a free daily petrochemicals news show. If you enjoy watching the video, at the end of today's daily news report, may I please request you to subscribe and to click on the bell icon. Also do remember to like this video by giving us a thumbs up. It encourages us to continue to bring you free informative news on a daily basis. I am Dave Simmons. It is Monday, November 6th. Let's start with energy and feedstock news. Crude oil prices fell on Friday despite an uptick in services activity in China, one of the world's topmost crude oil consuming countries. Brent crude prices fell by $1.96 settling at $84.89 per barrel while WTI futures decreased by $1.95 settling at $80.51 per barrel. Last Friday, OpenSpec napped the prices gained by $10 per metric ton at the $657 per metric ton CFR Far East Asia levels. Last week, a sluggish buying outlook and continuing weak demand sentiments from the downstream market pressured ethylene prices lower in Asia. On Friday, CFR Southeast Asia ethylene prices were assessed at the $940 to $950 per metric ton levels, while CFR Northeast Asia ethylene prices were assessed at the $860 to $870 per metric ton levels, both decreased by $25 per metric ton from the previous week. FOB Korea ethylene prices were assessed at the $850 to $860 per metric ton levels, while FOB Japan ethylene prices were assessed at the $845 to $855 per metric ton levels, both lower by $15 per metric ton week on week. Last week, propylene prices were assessed stable in Asia. Last week, ethylene and propylene prices gained in Europe. Last week, Ethylene prices edged lower while propylene prices quoted flat in the United States. Let's take a look at futures on China Dalian Commodity Exchange for today. On November 6, 2023, LLDPE prices are higher by RMB 10 per metric ton at RMB 82.45 per metric ton. PP prices are up by RMB 5 per metric ton at RMB at 7,700 per metric ton. PVC prices are higher by RMB 4 per metric ton at RMB 61.77 per metric ton. MEG prices are up by 40 renminbi per metric ton at RMB 41.88 per metric ton. In plant news, Penjurang Refining and Petrochemical, Prefchem, is likely to restart its number 2 polypropylene, PP, unit in mid November 2023. The unit was shut around early October 2023 owing to technical issues. Located at Penjurang, Malaysia, the number 2 PP unit has production capacity of 450,000 per metric ton year. Before I sign off, I would like to quickly tell you about the Polymer Update Academy. At Polymer Update Academy we provide customized corporate training courses to assist you in expanding your knowledge in the petrochemical, chemical, pharma, and allied sectors. Our tailor-made courses will be exclusive to each business, with renowned professors from the field of education with over 30 years of teaching experience conducting the courses. The objective of our courses is to provide operative professional training for you and your teams to help improve business processes and or products. That's all for today. Don't forget to watch our daily news video tomorrow to know more. This is Polymer Update, with me, Dave Simmons from Polymer Update Virtual World. Many thanks for watching.